Made in Preston Candover in Hampshire, and it's a version of a, a very long and magical ballad called Broomfield Wager, which I'm sure you know, and some of you probably sing. A long uh, story about a, um, a man and a woman who have a wager that uh, he wages her that she cannot go to a lonely, secluded uh, spot at night um, and meet him and return um, a maid. Well, in the, um, in the more long and magical version of this, she goes home and she um, fortunately knows a wise woman. Actually, Jeff knows a lot about wise women. He might even tell you now. <laughs> two, two things only. <laughs> two things that you have to know about the wise woman. One is that she is wise. <laughs> and the other... She is a woman. <laughs> 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 I'm trying to see if Ben Elton actually, but there we go. I'm a better person for that. Anyway, uh, the wise woman uh, gives her a spell so that she can um, she can win the wager. Um, this Hampshire version, Hampshire people are a little bit more down to earth and prosaic and they don't have all this wise woman magic stuff. But there is one little magical bit in it which I love. So I hear somebody say they've just got a puppy. Yeah. Oh, this you'll like this. It's got a talking dog. <laughs> it's a very sweet talking dog. It's a dear little talking dog. Um, and the man gets very cross with it and blames it for not waking him up at the opportune moment. And it says, I did my best, I tried, you know. It's a really nice dog, so I love this song particularly because of the talking dog. So look out for the dog. About it's a better seven, dog than he deserves. It's a better dog than he deserves. It's about seven verses in, I think, the dog appears. Oh, it's of a young squire, and he lived in the west, and he's courted a rich lady gay, and as they were walking together one night, a wager between them was laid. Oh, the wager it was laid, and the money down was paid, a hundred pounds up to ten, that a she might go to the merry broom fields and the maid she'd return once again. But when she has come to those merry blooming fields, she found her enough first sleep with his fine grey steed, with its silver saddle and his greyhound. Nine times she's walked around by his head, and nine times around by his feet, and it's nine times she's kissed his red rosy lips as he lay on the ground fast asleep. And the ring that she took from her middle finger, she's placed it on his. Thank you. 
Between.